Hey, what up, guys? This is Cody. And before I get into this video, I want to apologize for y'all for being very inactive on my channel here lately. I haven't posted a video in like over three months, and mainly because of my stupid, strict neighbors who wants to keep repeatedly calling the cops on me of for for the music or music they hear from uh, from over there which is kind of annoying and it's the reason why i haven't been act active on my channel because i'm truly trying not to get no fine from this and these neighbors across from where i live they they're the only ones who complains about my music nobody else in this neighborhood does so yeah that that's why i haven't been active at all on my channel and frankly i'm gonna have to just move because they 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 just want they just want to complain so much about it, and it, it's getting annoying. Where the point where it's affecting my YouTube channel, where I can't record videos for y'all, and even if I record videos and they hear it for a little bit, even for a minute or two, they'll just they they immediately call the cops on me, and I don't even know the cops arrive until I hear them knock on my door, and I've already been threatened to be fined multiple times. So, yeah, that's why I haven't been active on my channel, and I really apologize, guys. It's just a stupid neighbors that wants to be such a pain to uh, complain about this stuff. But, yeah. So, uh, about this video. So, um, going to show you my new Giga Sound that I just uh, got. Not too long ago. Now, my old one I sold for 300 to my parents because I was replacing it with this one. Uh, this one is the Samsung MX FS 9000 model. The one I had previous was the Samsung MX FS 8000, and that was 2300 watts RMS. This one is a little more at 2560 watts RMS, which is kind of odd because uh that's kind of an odd number for a watt wattage usually i would just say around 2600 watts just just to be even or just just a specific number instead of being like 2560 watts but yeah this is the samsung mx fs 8 the uh, 9000 and this is actually bigger than the one i had previous and this is even bigger than the lg so but as you can see, this is the main unit. Very, very different from the other one. And it's also a lot different too as well. And I think it has a about the same stuff on like the old gig, uh, like the other gig I used to have. But just in different, uh, different kind of layout and stuff. So as you can see, if I go to the front right here, you see you have power off and on. You have a beat waving button and that's the CD eject and stuff like that. This is the, I think this is the master volume, and then you have like these effects like panning, wah wah, uh, flanger and stuff. That's all the same with the other gig I had, and then you have like next, previous, stop, play and pause, tuner and aux, CD and Bluetooth. That's all. That was all in the other gig as well. It's just in a different way, in different mode. Then you have like, well, some of this right here is di new. I don't haven't seen that before. No easy search jog. I don't know if the other giga had that. And then you have delete, return, USB record, enter, display and demo. I think that's the, I can't remember what knob that one was. And here's the giga beat button or also known as the cop collar button. Football mode, the EQ. Has two USB inputs right here, and then you have mic aux in right there. I don't think that's where the disc goes in. As you can see, this is the top right here. This is a little higher still on there, but as you can see, it's uh, 2,560 watts RMS. And it's Bluetooth and stuff like that. All this stuff that they usually uh, display it for. And the thing is, is that between the MX-HS and the MX-FS models, the MX-HS is the Giga Sound Blast, and the MX-FS uh, is the Giga Sound Beat right here. So this is the MX-FS model, so that's called a Giga Sound Beat. 
And my other one also was called a Giga Sound Beat because it was an MXFS model. Now, if uh, the other ones like the MX FS, uh, no, MXHS uh, 8000, 7000, 8500, 8, uh, 9000, all those, those are the uh, Giga Sound Blast because they're the HS models. But this is a. Yeah. Hand fall over, but this is a, a FS model. As you can see, it has two 15s. The subs are still 15s. The difference on the top is that there's a single 8 inch uh, mid driver. Now, unfortunately, this light right here does not uh, work because of the when I bought it from the owner of uh, the the part that hooked up to the light with uh, which I still have right here. This came out. I had to fix. Right here so I gotta fix that to get that light working but they, it will work when I get it fixed and then of course those are the horn those are horn tweeters I think the other ones that the Giga had what horns I think they were like compression tweeters or something I'm not sure and then of course that's the base port underneath so the air comes out stuff like that and these speakers are pretty big they are massive they're like the size of of a washing not like a dishwasher or something or like a mini they're like mini fridge size so they are pretty large and they're bigger than even the lg now i'll be interested to make a video if i ever can of the lg ck99 versus the Sam uh, samsung mx fs 9000 for y'all guys to see how these two stereos perform because they're pretty equal in wattage to me. I think the LG uh, LG CK99 is says 5,000 watts. Totally, totally a lie. To me, it's more like 2,800 watts. I think. And this is rated at 2,560 watts, or I would say 2,600 watts, just to be clear. So they're pretty close in terms of sheer power. But the LG CK99 does sound very different from the samsung again but we'll do that a comparison in a speaker uh, a stereo battle video whenever i can but yeah i just wanted to show y'all my new giga sound that i bought and i bought this for 600 which is a great deal because the old giga i bought was oh, was a thousand and it was uh in worse condition than this was so yeah the owner kept pretty, uh, the owner I bought from this did keep it in pretty good condition. It wasn't that dusty and it wasn't much, everything works and stuff, so that's a good thing. But yeah. But anyway, guys, that'll be it for this video. Uh, don't forget to like the video, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video whenever I can make another one. Hopefully I can start going back uploading weekly. But seeing I got my neighbors or those strict neighbors around, that's gonna be very hard to do. I'm gonna at least try to, and hopefully these neighbors don't be such a pain in the ass to just, just even with this stuff. But anyway guys, that'll be it for this video and I will see y'all in my next video.